MetaGrid features a dedicated predefined view set for Cubase based on app-specific commands handled by a dedicated generic remote device. You can download it from Metasystem IO website. You need to import the provided Metasystem XML file in Cubase. To do this, go to Devices, Device Setup, Click the plus icon in the upper left corner. The list with the predefined controllers will appear. Choose Generic Remote. Click Import and import the provided Metasystem XML file. Set MIDI input output ports as Metasystem Cubase in out. You also need to exclude Metasystem's MIDI input port from MIDI ports visible in all MIDI input group in Cubase. To do this, go to Device Setup, MIDI Port Setup, under MIDI Folder, uncheck the checkbox in the All MIDI Input column that correspond to Metasystem Cubase in. If you don't follow this procedure, you can experience MIDI feedback on MIDI tracks. Don't exclude Metasystem MIDI in if you want to receive actions with MIDI messages. Now you have hundreds of Cubase commands at your fingertips. To assign a command to your button, find a command by going to the respective commands group or search for it with a search function.